Here's your NBC 26 update. I'm Nina Sperano. With President Trump testing COVID-19 positive, it's no surprise his campaign schedule is being upended. Today, the campaign released a statement saying that all scheduled campaign events for Mr. Trump are being moved to virtual or temporarily postponed, end quote. There will not be a rally in Green Bay on Saturday. In other news, the U.S. government reports 661,000 jobs were added in September and in the final jobs report before the presidential election. It's the third month in a row of a decline in gains, which experts say could signal a slowdown in the economic recovery. The good news, the unemployment rate is now below 8 percent for the first time since March. And new video shows Wisconsin National Guard members battling wildfires in California. They flew two Black Hawk helicopters from Madison to Sacramento last month to help. Since then, the crews have not stopped flying, using a 660-gallon firefighting bucket to douse those flames. California is dealing with its worst fire season ever. Let's send it over now to Chief Meteorologist Cameron Moreland with more on our weather here at home. Cameron? Nina, we are following an NBC 26 weather alert. Another cold night is on the way, and for that reason, the National Weather Service has issued a frost advisory for most of northeast Wisconsin. So just like last night, with a widespread frost expected, make sure you cover tender plants or bring them inside if you want to protect them. Overnight lows will be in the upper 20s to lower 30s across most of the area. Temperatures will be a little bit warmer near the shoreline of Lake Michigan. Tomorrow... It's going to be another chilly day, feeling more like early November than early October. We're going to have mainly cloudy skies. We'll have a few showers from time to time, especially as we head into the afternoon and evening. Have a great night, everybody.